Welcome back to the Kitchen Table Podcast. If you're not subscribed, please do it. And if your grandparents start to subscribe, you're doing it wrong. Welcome back, everyone. Yes, hey, welcome, this is welcome. Episode five. five. Episode five. 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 Episode five. Um, we're doing pretty good, I'd say. Hey. We have to welcome with that. I'm doing pretty good. We have to welcome back Alessio. Alessio is back. He's... Hello, everybody. Um, yeah. Um, he was on vacation. Um, out. How was vacation actually? Great time. Great time. Great time. Beach. Um, you're in South Carolina, if I'm correct. North. North Carolina. North. North Carolina. I'm north. You know what I mean? How'd you, how'd you meet and greet, yeah? Yeah. Okay, well, it was pretty bad. Pretty bad? Got like 50 people on my doorstep. Did they like violate you? Invade your privacy? Yeah. I, I told you guys. Told all so I said the laptop. Leave me alone. Leave him alone. Leave him alone. You don't need people with knives at the door. Um, yeah, so. Guess what? We hit 50 subscribers. Yes. I think that's pretty good. Yes. 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 I mean, that's pretty good. We beat our goal. Our goal was um, 50 by the end of the month. It's not the end of the month yet. Yeah. Um, so that's a big step forward. Um, I think next episode, we may do a mukbang. mukbang. So we're going to grab up some food and we're going to grub on the food. Or mm. not. I don't know if you guys, we don't know where it's going to be from here, but it's going to be a mukbang. What? Is he going to be in the room? Can we tell him about that? Shoot. We'll be right back. Okay, we're back. We had a team meeting. Yeah, a quick team meeting. And to talk about something. Um, yeah. yeah, we are. It's going to be a struggle, but we are going to have an episode next week. And it will most likely be a mukbang. And it, will, it will be a struggle because um, going to work. us three are going to work somewhere that we're not going to tell you, but we're going to work somewhere. We're going to go get that bread. You know what I mean? It's gonna be a fair. It's gonna be a fair. We're gonna be uh, making the moolah. We're gonna be making some lemonade. Some lemonade. What's that? That looks The thumbnail. All right. Um, making some French fry, cut potatoes. Fudge. Yes. That's how you shake it. Ooh, did you get spr- did you get um splattered by the yeah, sucks. It it hurts. Burns. So bad. <laughs> nice. Um <laughs> but like by the third day you'll be used to it. It doesn't even tell me. Like, oh yes. By the third day it doesn't even hurt. That's what he told me that and it's true. Yeah, we're gonna make some good bread. We'll, we'll be gone for five days. Um But we usually record on Wednesdays and stuff like that, but we will not we are leaving Wednesday, so we don't know what we're doing. We're still up in the air what we're gonna do. But I'm thinking Tuesday. You all there will be an episode, we won't let you guys down. We would I really hope this one. We will not let you guys down. Um, we have some um, good topics today. Like honestly, yeah. Like, some I say, I think you should actually stay for this one. We got some yeah, like, got pretty some good. We have some debatable topics. Some you could debate deep. with us. You could debate with us. Alex, do you believe in paranormal activity? Oh, that's a tricky one, Kevin. Tricky. Why'd you ask, Alex? I. Believe so. Yes, mm, I think I, I do. do. I don't at all. Right. I, in fact, do not believe in paranormal activity. I think every paranormal video slash TV show, I think they're all fake, fake, fake. Or it's just a coincidence. Well, it's a coincidence. So it's keeping the wind. The wind, the wind is blowing. The yeah, wind. when in somebody's house and the, when the blanket moves off there. Yeah, but still, I think it's, I think it's all staged. I so hope are we, if it is real, this is what I'm saying. This so is the why, Conjuring, this is why, no. Annabelle, it's all fake. They're movies. I would say, I would say, but no, it's not true stories. True story. But I would say, based. I would it's say, a real Annabelle doll. Listen, I would say that it's fake because if it's so common and it's everyone in these videos, why has it never happened to me? It never happened to me. Yeah, I, I think it would have happened by now. Mm. Tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Tonight, I'll, I'll give you guys a call if somebody's pulling me off my dick. Yeah, um, I don't think it's real. I mean, I think some things could be real. Like, yeah, like, honestly, I believe kind of in, like, demons or dark spirits. Oh, he believes in dark spirits. But I don't believe in ghosts. I don't think ghosts are real. Well, paranormal activities could 
be any of that stuff. So p spirits or ghosts. But what I would say is I really actually, I actually enjoy paranormal activity like movies. I don't. The ones that are me, I, uh, we don't, you tell All the good ones are most likely based off a true story. I like getting a spook. I like being spooked. Yeah. I mean, you cover your eyes and plug your ears every time you watch a scary movie. When I was seven. I was Maybe seven. If, like a year or two ago. <laughs> like a year or two ago. Um, yeah, I just choose not to watch them because, I mean, I don't enjoy it because I watch them. Just don't put the... in my closet. Yeah, Kevin is not a watcher, everybody. He's a listener. He's a doer. Wait, well, he doesn't listen either. So usually when we have parties and we all yeah. watch a scary movie, Kevin usually goes into a different room. Uh, that was me. Jaden also does the same thing. That was two years ago. Remember the one time Jaden and Kevin both went in the closet and watched YouTube. We went in the closet at my birthday party. No, that when was we watched. When we watched. Um, what was it called? I know what it's called. Baba Duke. Baba Duke. Baba Duke. No, we were in. There's a Baba Duke too coming out. We were in the. Um, not playroom. true story. We were in the playroom. It's very. Huh? We we're in the playroom. Well, it's Jayden, very fictional. Jaden and Kevin went to the playroom and did not watch Baba Duke. Yeah, I just don't enjoy it. I mean, yeah. I heard him say the Babadook three times. He comes. Babadook, Babadook, Babadook. Baba, Baba, Baba. Um, <laughs> I'm just looking here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the Babadook. <laughs> the Babadook. Um, so, I don't know if this is like you guys or your like school or wherever you live, but every teenage girl known to man. Known to man. Every single morning, maybe three times a day, goes to get coffee at Dunkin' Donuts or Starbucks or wherever you. But the start. question, but the question is, do you really need? Is it? it for social media or do you really need that? coffee? Do you really need it? Are you going to get that coffee because, oh, uh, I I'm want to, I'm I want tired. to, I am too tired. I need to wake up. Or are you going just so you can take out your phone and take a Snapchat? Like, tell us right now. On the to, to, to a point, it gets kind of like. Like, I feel like you definitely don't need it. Like, it's kind of like, you're addicted. You're literally addicted. There's some rumors about coffee, too. <laughs> I, I, I'm jumping in on that. <laughs> Let's see what happened. <laughs> I just drew all the I saw it, too. <laughs> yeah, but, like, do you really need coffee? Like, I really don't think you do. Like, it's not even that good to begin with. I know people want to think. I don't like coffee. There's rumors about coffee. coffee. Yeah. Makes you tiny. Makes you short. Really? Is this true or false? There's also rumors that when you go to Starbucks, they, yeah, spell, you, they spell your name wrong on purpose. They draw in more people. Let us know if coffee makes you short down below. Yeah, I, mean, I don't have too many topics. I don't there. drink coffee. I don't remember the last time I did. I don't think I ever did. I maybe once. Kind of sip. I think maybe once. Too. Starbucks for I, uh, that's that's not considered coffee. That's more like a milkshake. I get one of those. Milk, but, milkshake. But I don't like no coffee. I go to Dunkin' Donuts to get donuts. To get donut. donut. Die. Not to get coffee to get donuts. Dunkin'. I don't get a coffee and then put the donut on the straw because I'm not sleeping. Dunkin' Donuts. Hey yeah, just say it. <laughs> Dunkin' Donuts. 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 <laughs> At Dunkin' Donuts. Dunkin' Donuts. Not Dunkin' Coffee. But Dunkin' Coffee. Donuts. Dunkin donuts. Donuts. Dunkin' Milk. Dunkin' Straight from the cow. You know <laughs> Dunkin' Milk. That was awful. Let me try. Alex. Daddy. Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Big news, big news, big news. Big news, big news, big news. Big news, big news. Merch coming <laughs> The NBA is back. Let's get a clap. Show a clap. Baseball's also back. You probably don't tonight. care because not want people like baseball. We should, but do, we should do a poetry story. One day, one day. NBA's back. We had a, there was, I mean, the actual games aren't back. We had some scrimmages last night and we had some scrimmages tonight. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. And also, MLB opening day is tomorrow. Um, I will not, I'm not talking to that. That catches my interest. I, I like baseball. baseball. I hate baseball. You know any baseball fans out there? Oh, yeah, he runs cross country. That doesn't associate with baseball. I don't that, care. You would say track in that? You would say track then? I, I still don't mm. care. But Alex um, also runs track? Yeah. Mm. But, yeah, um, sports are returning. 
Um, Bull Bull went off yesterday. Bull Bull. Because let's say we talked about that every time. 16 points, 10 rebounds, and 6 blocks. Pretty good. They caught the dub, 89 to 82. Big dub, big dub. Um, yeah, um, the Clippers won. Paul George led. I believe he, he had 18 points, something like that. Um, the Heat beat the Sacramento Kings. Duncan Robinson popped off. Yeah, Duncan Robinson had 18 points. Four threes in the first five minutes of the game. Really? That goes off, man. Um, breaking news. Like, we literally just heard this. Um, Jake Paul versus Nate Robinson in a boxing match. Yes. And guess who they're the undercard of? The one, the only, Mike Tyson. The legend. Yeah, the we're legend. coming up. The myth. We're, we're going, we're all three. We already bought the tickets. We're going to the fire. Yeah, we're going to the fire. <laughs> we won't have an episode. Right, sorry, right, sorry. Right. It's September. I put your arms up. It's, it's up in September. <laughs> but. September 12th, actually. We're doing January. We will be there. Expect, up us, soon. expect us to be talking to Jake. We'll be, we'll be in the we'll, we'll be there. Hey, you guys got on that fight. Even if you don't care. Mike Paul. Tyson and Jake Paul. Mm. I have to go, Alex with, Nate. I have to go with Nate Robinson. Alex is always Alex Jake, Jake Paul. Paul. So even though he thought Jake Paul was going to win, he wouldn't be saying. Who do you think, Ryan? I said Jake Paul. You say Jake Paul? Yeah. yeah. Nate you Robinson. just switched right to Logan Paul in case I... Kicked his ass. I said not. He didn't kick his ass, but he won. He still lost. Yeah, he did lose. Well, he did not. He took a fatty L. But he came he didn't back. Take a fat L. He, he, really he came back. It was not a fat L. All I'm going to say is Logan Paul is a better boxer, is obvious. It's just he wasn't punching a lot. Just he wasn't playing his right. If he would have never That's done that little ball, he would have won. He would have won if he didn't do that. He would have won. Some of you watching this are salty about Like, if you, saw, if you saw the form, like. Logan, you if you're watching this, I'll join the Maverick Club. Yeah, Logan <laughs> Paul, like. I like you, man. You're, you're pretty cool, dude. Which is his sparring footage. Yeah, Alex, beast. Alex, likes, Alex thinks his sparring footage is good. It's cracked, dude. It's so good, dude. I can't believe it. But so I thought you were for sure going to fight KSI. In yeah, I thought he was, but about. I guess KSI didn't want hey, to. Bro, I'm saying you got this. You know, speaking of KSI, I've been, <laughs> I've been watching a lot of side men lately. Wait, Alex, have you ever seen Nate Robinson box? Yeah. Yeah, wait, I just showed him the video. Oh, you was, was it good? Yeah, but it was actually it looked better. It's pretty now. quick. I mean, maybe you could do little yeah, who's quick? Quick? slides under Jake Paul's legs yeah, and put him in a pop. You know who's quick? Who? Click. Click. Ryan. Click. Ryan. Ryan. Yeah, I was going to say that. Ryan Garcia. Ryan Garcia. <laughs> Freaking beast, dude. Because there were like 60 like, punches in him. Thir- in like 50 Ryan seconds. Garcia is scary. Scary man. Scary, scary man. Really scary. Like, man. I would hate to get into a ring with Ryan Garcia. Ryan Garcia. Ryan Garcia. Ryan Garcia. Ryan Garcia. Um, <laughs> if you guys pay attention to the UFC, Jorge Masvidal. Okay. He lost, actually. Oh my god, our recent video just got a view. I just watched it go up. Let's go. Let's go, guys. Let's go. We just gave it our view. Speaking of views, you know, our episodes lately haven't been hitting the hundreds. We want to get to the hundreds. Triple digits every time. And like I, like I said, um, you know, this, was, this one's a good one. We had a lot of good topics. We just stay. Stay a while. Um, and new outro music. Bam, bam. Yeah, it's pretty good. No more ever glow. No, no, no. I don't know if everyone ever heard no, it, but no, 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 no. Yeah, but um, no, 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 no. we're gonna go for more of a chill effect. No, 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 no. Skip the outro right now and just come back. Yeah, just come back. <sighs> All right. Um, said, actually, when you guys are going to watch the outro, we're gonna take a quick break. That's. <laughs> yeah. Um, we're gonna take a quick break. Um, when we come back, we will hit you with that. I hope it's an upset. I think Jake's gonna win. Well, Alex, he just announced it. Like, you just think he's gonna win automatically because you don't like Jake. No, I actually think he'll win. <laughs> Alex, you heard. It's... We feel like dancing. Ready? I said, not the fucking spell that. Did I know that? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back, everyone. Oh, Ryan. Right. Welcome back, everyone. Um, took a quick break. Been another little accident. Mm-hmm. Alex spilled his water completely. Yeah. Um. Okay. I mean, but we're gonna bounce back. And now, what do you all been looking <laughs> for? Excuse well, me. Well, bless you. Your favorite time of the, the whole entire video. <coughs> it is the dad, dad joke, joke of the day. day. Um, today's dad joke is what concert 
costs just 45 cents. You know? No. 50 cent featuring Nickelback. Mmm. <laughs> and I think that's a, it's a pretty good one. Like, like, it's not like dad jokes, you know, you don't always just like laugh out loud at them, but you're just like, yeah, I get it. I get it. I mean, I get it. I get it. <laughs> um, <coughs> yeah, we had some juicy topics in the first half. But, um, even I, juicier ones. Yeah, even juicier. Um, it's just, I'm just gonna ask this straight up. Do you believe in aliens? Do you believe in aliens? <laughs> Do you, Alex? No. Ryan, I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay. I do? What? In a sense. It's opposite for both of us. They don't believe in paranormal. I do. That's because somewhere the universe is infinite. So, it's so yeah, there has to be. Somewhere else in the universe, really, really far, is probably another Earth. There has to be another there's species. 100% there's got to be something else out there. There has to be something. There's no way in hell that we're the only ones here. There has to be something. Like, the something. universe is so. And when I say aliens, I'm not talking like, you know, the ones with the big, the green ones with the big heads. I'm just yeah. talking other humans. It's still going. Right. Um, yeah, I think the universe is way too big for there not to be more people because it's infinite. But in our galaxy, there is no. I don't. No in our galaxy, I do not believe so. The Milky Way. Another <coughs> galaxy? Yeah. Yes. Many, I think. And we would never find them. It's weird. They're both on life right now. We have no idea. Yeah, it's like, I, I kind of find they that They probably weird. have flying cars and shit. Mm. Just imagine that. Like, that's crazy. Like, it's a whole other world. Yes, a lot of people think that. It's like Minecraft. But have different worlds and villagers. The Nether. And Steve's. Um, yeah, I, I think I believe in aliens. It's not our galaxy. I, I just don't. Oh. And I don't know why. Some people think different of me. Think different <coughs> than me about this topic. But the beach. People don't like the beach. Some people. I just don't understand that. The beach Ryan, do you like the beach? Oh, excuse yeah. me. Beautiful, beautiful. Ryan likes the beach. I like the beach. I think it's awesome. I like going to the water. I also think it's awesome. People are like, afraid of it. Like, I mean, it's water. I mean, I can obviously fight a shark and win. Like, I'm not too worried about that. Um, I don't know what Ryan's worried about, honestly. Alex, you're not really worried about anything, right? No. Alex is the size of a shark, so I mean, it doesn't really matter. Um, yeah, I mean, I bet Alex bench presses more than any shark out there, so. Yeah, the shark's arms are like three inches long, so. Three inches, they don't have arms, stupid. Fence, sorry, sorry! Okay. Um, so we have some big news, like, this is pretty big. <coughs> big, big, big. We have social accounts, like social medias. And, and I think it's pretty big. We have an Instagram and a Twitter at the moment. Um, you should go check those out. The handles are um, Kitchen Table Podcast we for the Instagram. And, but instead, in the I in Kitchen is a one. I, um, Twitter is kitchen the kitchen table 14 um you can go check us out we on can put both. these in the link in the description please give us a follow we'd really appreciate that um it means a lot guys we are going to be hopefully we'll get a decent amount of followers that'd be awesome that'd be really nice um and this is a it's not really a commonly asked question i'd say we're pretty young but like like, what age do people, like, plan to live to? Because, like, some people, like, they all want to live to 100. Or, like, they want to live to, like, 90. Depends on how healthy you are. Yeah. Don't do drugs. Personally, I would like to live to about 90, 95. Because, like, I feel like when, once you're that, like, you're, like, almost close to 100. I think, <coughs> like, and there's, like, really no, like, there's not, it's not like there's no need to live, but you're probably miserable. But, like, I don't want to be miserable. Alex, what about you? Uh, if I hit 80, I'll be happy. 80, Ryan? 80. 80. That's okay. still, like, very, still a low chance of that. Like, a lot of people I don't make it to 70. I'll be alive with, basically, everybody that I know from now dead and by myself. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Yeah, I don't want to be lonely. 
But I also don't want to die before my spouse. That's crazy to think about. That's yeah, scary to think about. Like one day that's gonna actually happen. You die. You're alone. Mm, that's scary. <laughs> my stomach just got my parts. Yeah, I feel like it's like really scary to think about. Like we're gonna be fifty one day. Like we're not gonna be able to move like this. Mm. And that's really Fifty still, still kind of young. The fact that we're gonna be dead one day. Yeah, that's really scary. Like I don't want to die. There's nothing you can do about it. We love life, man. Love life. <laughs> <laughs> that was so weird. <laughs> One day they might find a an HIV that makes you young again. An HIV that they, they, no, Oh my God! Wow. They do plan. An on HIV. Doing they do plan on doing that. That make an IV. An IV that <laughs> they do plan on making they, something. They make AIDS that. that makes you young again. <laughs> <laughs> this is one scientist in India that said he told News Report he said he does not plan on dying. It's <laughs> HIV, isn't it? <clears throat> you he said says, they're gonna make an HIV to make people younger. He said, he said quote unquote, he told me he said he no. does not plan on dying. He plans on finding a way. Who? Like, this this scientist from India. He said he doesn't plan on dying. I want to die. He has he he thinks he's gonna crack the code of keeping us alive. And okay. Everybody we know can take it. We can just keep going. You don't do it that way. We'll be mutated. We'd be we be like. Be oh like, no, that wouldn't be good. Because I mean that like the sun's gonna blow up eventually. <laughs> and this is all we get overpopulated. This is all we get. It's IV, bro. This is some deep stuff. This is HIV, like a dumbass. Think about that. I heard you die. I heard you die. Oh my that, god. Yeah. And and HIV. I was trying to tell you that. Done. I was trying to tell you that. Like, can you imagine being part of the human race? Said, you said, oh my god. Can you imagine being, HIV? Can you imagine being part of the human I race? I am dumb. Can you imagine being part of the human race that has to experience the sun blowing up? Like, dude, There's going to be an HIV that makes like a sure. billion years, I'm pretty sure that's what's happened. Dude, that's like scary to think about, too. Even though we're not going to be alive. Like, also, then I think about, like, like that like whole reoccurring life thing, like reincarnation. Like, we would eventually see it. Like, it would eventually happen to us. Like, if that's true. Like, the whole reincarnation. So you are stupid. Um, but, like, that's, like, to me, really scary to think about. Like, I don't like. Yeah, we're going to have it. Yeah, we're going to have it. Amen. Take me to Oh, like a dog. Right I got. I tell you, my sins will never stop in your mind. Um, yeah. <laughs> the more story, enjoy the present. Yeah. Don't think about the future. <clears throat> Don't think about it. Like, we shouldn't even be thinking about episode 10 right now. We should be grateful that we're here for episode 5. Right? You know how long that we've written the episode? <laughs> it's like, okay, you guys are gonna write this. He got, he got shot. <laughs> oh my He's gosh. Dead. I would say like I'd probably did, I'd just probably end the whole thing. <laughs> if one of us died, I would not post ever again. But we're not gonna die. We're here for the long run. Unless, unless we die, unless we die on our way to. <laughs> You're wondering, Ryan is he was shot? <laughs> oh my god! That could happen though. Like, that's the scary part. In the world we live in today, I guess it can. <clears throat> Deep stuff. Yep. I also think about like I kind of do want to be reincarnated. Like I like life. I don't. No awkward. Yeah, I don't. I thought you use the term awkward when you are gonna live when no one else. When you live again, it's just so weird that like, you're living and you have no idea. What, like here's my theory. Your mom was. Here's a the theory I kind of believe in. Deja vu is from reincarnating. So like I think like you know me and Alex, I had deja vu with Alex like before we started filming. And like, I wonder, I feel like maybe like you had a conversation just like that in one of your week, in one of your previous. No, I think we're going to have it. Yeah, me too. I hope so. Weird believers in God. And I have a good theory on why, but I'm not sharing it. I don't like talking about religion. Mm -hmm. I also don't like talking about death, but I do it sometimes. Death is a scary thing, you know. Don't worry about it right now. We're young and alive. Yeah, we are not young and alive. Thank don't you. do drugs, you'll be alright. I don't plan on drinking either. What would be dope if the sun didn't blow up? So that has to be a choice. <laughs> sun ain't gonna blow up. It, it, it's already, like in a billion years, it's gonna blow it's guaranteed up. guaranteed gonna blow up eventually. It's guaranteed it's <laughs> gonna happen. <clears throat> That's like scary, dude. Like on the but we're not gonna be here for it. It's gonna be in a billion years, is what it's predicted. No, it's seven billion. Or more. Seven billion people. Seven billion people. Let me look this up. 
it's gonna blow up though. Like it's gonna happen. <laughs> but don't be a new wor world and new life. And then you can't. You can't do anything. I mean, we can we'll still. Find another we can planet, still. But, no. Um, like, I mean, there's already talks. Like when we're older. <laughs> yeah, there's when we're older. They're saying that you're gonna be able to live on Mars if you want. Mars. Yeah, but actually, I think. I feel like, like if the sun blows up, I think it's gonna reach Mars too. It like, will reach everything. <laughs> But this is what imagine taking a Earth vacation right now. It's like right now. It's like okay, I'm gonna take a vacation to North Carolina, but in the future, I'm really, like, I'm gonna take a vacation That's to Mars. Six kids. billion years, the sun will swell. It will swell. <laughs> it won't explode. It will swell. It will get bigger. Like a little lump. When it gets swollen, it will start swelling. Just put it down on the table. That's gonna happen. Devouring the sun will blow up. Devouring Mercury, but it's Venus, kind of like, but Earth will persist. What? It's so like Earth will be so hot, like we won't be able to live though. Yeah, but it'll be like Mercury. But it would devour the other two. Like, they well, just think about if we lived on Mercury. That was oh wait, and Earth was. Oh my God, they can survive. Who we us? Yeah, yeah. It's you can move the Mars. You can live on Mars. Yeah, it has the same tone as us. It has four seasons. We have to figure out a good, all you have to yeah a way to find air quality. They can survive the sun. Guys, no, listen to this. You know how advanced the technology will be in four. Oh, and how listen oh, to this. Our red giant will die after 9.5 billion years, with Earth continue, continuing to orbit the sun's corpse indefinitely. So the Earth will never die, but the sun will. That's yeah, but you can't live without a sun. Yeah, the sun's gonna blow up. Yeah, we'll, we'll just, like, it'll literally, you, there'll be no light. There. <laughs> you can't get solar panels to heat the Earth. It just won't, that won't be good. We won't have a, <laughs> yeah. It doesn't affect we would the Milky Way. Okay. We Everything maybe, stays the same, but the we sun maybe will last six get months. cold. Six months at the most. Obviously, he said it'll get cold. <laughs> it'll get so cold that you wouldn't be able to step outside. Yeah. That's, Did you guys see Mr. Beast's video of him in um, an underground bunker that's like 12 stories deep? And if there's ever an that apocalypse, that that's where people live. I mean, what if you lived underground and you could survive? That'd be pretty sweet, but, but the soil would get so cold and everything would die, so. It like actually it'd probably take a year for everything to die if the sun like died because it would like start all start with the food chain. Like, I hate talking about this. <laughs> it's like so it. sad. It's, so it, it's very sad. But we're I'm grateful that we're here, man. You know. I did talk about that with my dad though. Uh, he said he, th crazy. he actually thinks it's crazy how before the future hour, be 40. they will create something that that could like make you young again, like not visibly, but like in your DNA, like you live longer. Yeah. Yeah. I think that'll definitely happen. And guys, we're it's graduating like high school in two years. Oh god. Oh god. That's, that's scary. Yeah, but I feel like 18 is still pretty young. That's really young. Mm -hmm. you're, not, you're, not, you're just becoming an adult. You're, you're, like, that, you're not even in our prime yet. Like, imagine having grandkids. Like, holy shit. <laughs> like, we're gonna be old, we can't do anything. <laughs> that's you, man. Watch it. Having a kid and watching it age is probably pretty sad, too. Yeah. I feel like it's cool. Having a kid is probably one of the best things ever. Ever. <laughs> like people, like, like people, with people kids even say like, like, oh, it's the best thing ever. <laughs> dads talk about like when they see their kid for the first time, it's just a different kind of feeling. Ryan, how's your sister been doing? Pretty well. Yeah, but that dude, that baby. Is Talking so about being a father when your boy over there is an uncle. An uncle. <laughs> talk about being a father. Ryan is a father. I'm not a father. I'm a founding father. <laughs> founding father of the USA. Who knows? If reincarnation's real, I could have been a founding father. There's a chance. Yeah. Um. Actually, there's not, because there was no founding. Well, there's still a chance, though, because like, this could be like my third time doing this. Yeah, imagine if I was a Lincoln. A could be Jesus. I could be Jesus. Because, like, Jesus is real. He's a real man. Like, I mean, I, I find that so crazy. Yeah, it's the fate of the of the world. I also don't like. I kind of believe in like fate, like like it's meant to happen. But I think some things are like, like no, nah, it's not meant to happen. Yeah, I say we had one more topic. What do you mean? Do you guys believe in karma? Karma? Yes. No. I, it's not. It doesn't have. Any, do you have any karma stories? I don't think it has anything to do with God. I just think it's just from what you do. What does that have to do with the self of God? How does that happen? I feel like karma never has anything to do with God. I think it's just na like, like it's a punishment. It's like natural. Like who's giving the punishment? Not no one's giving the punishment. I think it's just natural. Like I think it just happens because like 
It's, it's crazy how it works. I think if you make a mistake, you're you're due to make a you're due to like. I don't know. Why is that? Cause it got. I I kind of believe it, but I kind of don't. Karma's like. I feel like karma's also revenge. Like ca karma doesn't happen hundred percent of the time. It doesn't. I threw a glass at G. And what happened? You got karma, not me. <laughs> you got glass in your foot. It would be weird if I got glass in my foot. That would I mean, be... I guess you got karma, but it didn't happen recently. You chased Kevin, and then. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it's a tricky topic. Just don't talk about that. Yeah. Um, back out of that topic, because, you know, that was kind of, like, deep. That was pretty deep. It was that was the deep. longest topic. That was, that was deep. Um, we have a, we set a new goal. I think we all... July's <laughs> over, and we have hit our 50 goal right on time. When July's not over, it's really close to being over, though. But we hit the goal! We got, we're at 54 subs as we're talking. Yes. And the goal by end of July was 50, and we did it. And we're starting a basically a new thing where we're going to set a goal every month. And here's our August goal. Say it. 75 subscribers. Yeah. We're planning. It's the second month, so we're gonna we're, we're planning ahead. And we think I will we'll agree. Put, I think we're going to slow down this month a little bit. It's going to be a lot slower. But then you know, patience. Just pace. Just like for again. But this yeah, pace, patience. I think we can pull it off. I really do. Um. Yeah, I think. We'll be able to pull it off. Just tell all your friends that you're that, about this. This is hard Don't to forget our this socials. Is hard getting fifty. That's for sure. Yeah, because like this is now like the the middle. Like this is where it gets hard. This we're not this to have some We're no longer in the be in the beginning of the podcast. This is where you need to have some patience and watch, deal with the fact watch. that you're not getting along. If you're playing some video games, reading a book, watching TV, just throw it on. Fall, if you can't fall asleep at night, put it on. Put some headphones on. They don't have to watch us. They even look at Listen. us. Listen. Listen. Soothing voices, I would say. Really? Yeah. Um. Hopefully, by the end of August, we have like a different, maybe like a different, like maybe something like mics or something. We'll have something different. So yeah, we're, something. We're, we're gonna get some bank by the next by next week. So hopefully, <laughs> we can start making some investments. So I mean, yeah. Um, that's gonna wrap this episode up, actually. So. We talked about, we tried to make it more topic like today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I yeah. know you're not watching right now, but I hope you All right. And if you are, thank you for being here. Really appreciate Enjoy it. Enjoy the outro music. Bye yeah. your head. See you. Love you. See you guys. Bye. Peace. Peace.